What's up everybody? In today's video we're going to cover all the Star Wars news that just came out on Mando Monday. Check it out. What's up everybody and welcome back to Pop Empire. We are happy to have you. Like I said, we're gonna go over all the information that just came out on Mando Monday, which when this video comes out will be Wednesday, so two days ago. I'm sure a lot of you have already heard this news, but just in case you haven't, we'll give you the rundown right now. Now first, starting off with Target. Now the first thing that popped up there was there is a new Mandalorian exclusive that uh, hit for pre-orders on Target's website on Monday. Uh, however, I believe those pre-orders have since sold out. They sold out pretty quickly. However, keep your eye on that in case they reopen. And what that was, was a Mandalorian and Baby Yoda two-pack Black Series figures. Uh, it comes with a Baby Yoda pod and a number of other things. And the helmet actually comes off of the Mandalorian. So you can see uh, Din Djarin's face, pretty interesting. The head sculpt is kind of interesting looking, but I think it's really cool. It's an awesome addition. And also speaking more about Target, there's actually a number of other exclusives coming up. I'm popping all those up on the screen right now. So you can see there's a number of Mandalorian exclusives. There's also a Galaxy's Edge exclusive coming in December and they just keep coming and coming. So write these dates down. Uh, make sure you're ready to go on Target's website on these dates uh, to get your pre-orders in. Yeah, and also for some of those that were keeping an eye on uh, that release at Target. It was actually just listed as the Mandalorian build-up pack. I know a lot of people were wondering what that was going to be. So that ended up being that cool Black Series set. Now Walmart also had a Mandalorian build-up set and that's actually part of the Vintage Collection series which is the Mandalorian figure. Again his helmet does come off as well. It does come with the child. And also included in this set is that cool little ice cream maker that has the Beskar in it. And there will also be some little Beskar pieces included. So that also went up for pre-order on Monday. I'm not sure if that is still available. I would imagine that it's sold out by now. Luckily, I was able to score one, but just like all the other pre-orders, they were just kind of in and out all day, except for that Target one. Uh, as my brother said, that went very quick. So luckily we were able to snag one of those too. So video coming soon. And then also not sure if it was necessarily part of Mando Mondays, but uh, some cool revelations came to pass on Hasbro Pulse. And they did release photos of the painted Razor Crest of the HasLab project. So yeah, this thing looks pretty awesome. Of course, you got those Kind of tattered yellow stripes on there it looks chrome and metallic and all the weapons are painted and this thing just looks absolutely fantastic really looking forward to this releasing unfortunately we have to wait one year but it's uh, gonna be well worth it i believe yeah, and keeping on with the Vintage Collection line, uh, we actually did see two new figures added to the Vintage Collection from the Mandalorian TV show, which was the Armorer and Moff Gideon. Uh, both of these were up for pre-order on Hasbro Pulse. Uh, I believe they are also up for pre-order over on Dork Side, just in case Hasbro Pulse is sold out. So we will leave a link down below for those. And that's another thing too, for a lot of these pre-orders, uh, check out Dork Side. Uh, a lot of times they'll still have them available uh, when the other websites have already sold out their pre-orders. So make sure you go ahead and check that out as well. And just moving along for those that might have seen in one of our past videos where we were talking about the rumor of the new retro collection coming out uh, that was confirmed on Monday and that is all Mandalorian figures. So you will get the Mandalorian, you get Cara Dune, also Quill, IG-11, uh, Moff Gideon, and Grief Karga. So personally I think these figures look really great. I think these will go great with uh, vintage collection figures if you're trying to build up uh, like a Mandalorian set. Now I'm not sure who will be carrying these when they do release, however uh, these again were up for pre-order on Pulse. And again over on dark side and then just a heads up i uh, believe those figures don't actually release till may of next year so it's gonna be a little bit of a wait but uh, might be worth the wait and then one other thing i wanted to point out to you it is mandalorian and it is a figure however it wasn't announced on mando monday it was actually announced i believe at one point last week or the week before uh, and it is the new bandai my show movie realization uh ronin mandalorian figure this thing is awesome of course he looks like a samurai uh, there's a number of other figures in this line that you may have seen like darth vader uh there's a interesting kabuki c-3po uh, a number of other figures i believe there's a darth maul there's even a kylo ren and a captain phasma but these things are fantastic uh so I would say go ahead and check out uh, this new uh, My Show movie realization, Ronin Mandalorian. I'll put all the links to all this stuff down in the description. And finally, just in case you missed it, also announced on Mando Monday was actually a new remote controlled Baby Yoda. Uh, this is coming out by Mattel and uh, we have a video for you. Check it out. From Star Wars Mandalorian, it's the Child Feature Plush RC. Now you can control where the child goes or activate follow me mode to have the child find you. So is your friend staying for dinner? He only eats frogs. It's the Mandalorian Child Feature Plush RC. Battery's not included. 
To watch a video that YouTube suggests for you, click that video to your left. To watch our last video, it's gonna be the one to the right. We'd also love it if you would subscribe, and to do that, click the link up above our heads. That would be awesome. We'll see you all in the next video. Peace, everybody. See ya.